So I play tested natural gut for the last month and I finally broke the strings. Is it worth that high price points? Let's find out. What's up guys, Tricks of Kev back again with another video and yeah, it's been a while and I apologize for that. It's been really crazy, really hectic off the court. But um, yeah, I'm back again and hopefully I can stay consistent to my Sunday upload schedule. All right, back to the string review. So a little backstory on why I decided to try out gut. So I stumbled upon a video from My Tennis HQ where Karu gave his thoughts on natural gut and why he liked it and why he decided to switch to it. And he, he mentioned that one of the main reasons that he never tried natural gut was because of how expensive it is. And I feel many people feel the same way. The reason why lots of people don't use natural gut, at least at the recreational level, is because of its price point. A set of Babolat natural gut or Wilson ranges between 40 and 50 bucks. And my real a uh, poly is normally 70 bucks. Why? 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 One set is half the cost of, you know, a whole reel. The biggest selling point for me was when he mentioned that it's especially good in those defensive situations where you don't necessarily have the whole weight of your body behind the shot. And so you kind of have to give that flick of the wrist. With natural gut, that flick of the wrist is good enough to still hit a quality shot. When I heard that, it got me interested because that's one of my sticking points with my game. Uh, well, besides the overheads. So I decided, you know what? What the hell? Let's get one pack of uh, natural gut. So I decided to go with uh, Wilson natural gut 16 gauge in the mains. And then my regular poly, which is torn up big hitter silver, which is also 16 gauge in the cross. And so what did I think of this setup? Man, <laughs> I was actually really surprised. I actually really like it. The uh, easy access to power, the amazing feel from the gut mains. You know, I feel it really enhanced my attacking game. Like it was so much easier to hit the same like forehand bombs that you guys see on my channel with half the effort. And then the enhanced feel and comfort gave me more confidence in my volleys. I've been playing my attacking game on like super aggressive mode. And here's the crazy part. The reason why I never really tried natural gut is because I was worried that, you know, it wouldn't last that long, you know, and especially for his price point, I don't want to be short 40 or 50 bucks because it broke on me within two hours. But durability was not an issue at all with my hybrid setup. Like I got a total of 14 hours of play. And what's even crazier is that it wasn't the gut mains that broke at the 14th hour. No, it was the poly cross. <laughs> and funny enough, on a serve. And I've never broken a string off a serve. And Karu was spot on about it being very helpful in those defensive situations because you will see many times in this match highlights where I'm pulled out wide on the backhand side and I'm hitting some insane slices. Either whether it be a knifer or it just lands really deep, like close to the baseline and it would keep me in the point. So would I recommend natural gut? Yeah, yeah, I would. Especially if you're not a string breaker and you can afford it, why not? Just don't do it in a full bed. Definitely do it in a hybrid. And that wraps up the Gut Check mini series. Thank you for watching as always, and I hope you enjoyed the series as much as I did. Onto the match highlights. What you're about to watch is the true power of natural gut. I'll just leave it at that. Thank you for watching and catch you next time.
Thank <laughs> you. 